Hey everyone, welcome back, I'm Jason. In today's video, we're going to unbox and set up the all new Superbox S4 Pro. So I got here the brand new Superbox. This is the S4 Pro model. It's got pretty much everything else, like the S3, it's a dual band. You know what, let's open this up. That's better. So it's a dual band. It's a 2T2R, two gigs, plus 32 gigs, supports 6K. It's an old TA box and supports H.265. Let's open it up. We got the super box there. Standard American plug. Once again, you can order this box with the plug for your region. HDMI. The remote control with the voice command. And manual. Let's put this all aside. Because this is what we want to check out. There you guys have it. So it's the S4 Pro Super Box. So you got uh, two antennas. You got your optical, your LAN port, HDMI, AV, and IR, and your plug. There's your restore button right there, USB and USB 3.0 and your micro SD card slot. So overall looks not much is different from the S2 and the S3. So let's plug this guy in and let's uh, set it up. So the box is booting up. So you have to hit the agree, which is going to wait. There it is. Go to agree. Over here, we pick our screen size. The monitor I'm using right now, it's 100%. Next, yours might be different. Over here, you can pick Wi-Fi or Ethernet. I'm going to use Ethernet. There we go. Now we hit finish. And that's all to it. Now, if you look here, it is different. They changed the, the interface. So we head over to the App Store. Then App Store again. Confirm. Just gotta wait for this to finish. There it is. 
Now we could go to App Store. Just gotta wait for this to finish. Press OK. And there you go. And now we could download it here. If you pay attention to the top, it actually, this is version four. So I'm just gonna click on these three here. And they do have the TV backup as well, which we want. So we're gonna download this one as well. I believe this app is only available on on the S3 and the S4. So we're just waiting for the the check mark. While those are still doing the download, we can check out some of the other ones here that they added. Seems like they added quite a bit of apps now to this box. So these are all preloaded already onto the box. Even has the, the cleaner right here as well. Let's check it out. Okay, so we got two, three, we got one left. We'll just wait for this one to finish up, then we'll exit out of here. There we go. So we got the last one downloaded. Hit the home button on the remote. Now, same as all the other boxes. We go live TV, press add. We look for it. There it is right there. When you want to see the check mark, hit the return. Return out one more time. Now we do that to the VLD. Press OK. VLD. Exit. Return back again. Playback. It's right there. Playback. Added. So over here, I like to add a few of them here as well. So the all new backup app. They just added we're gonna i'm gonna put it down here that's a great app if you guys ain't familiar with it you guys really need to try it out but keep in mind it's only comes with their s3 pro box and this new s4 pro box so we're going to test the microphone button on this remote control Now, we, if you press the microphone button, you're going to get this. And this is a one-time setup. So it says right there on the screen, we're going we're to press the OK and the return button at the same time for eight seconds. And we're going to wait for the light. Okay, we're going to wait for the light to start flashing. Then once it does, you're going to press the OK button. All right, so we're going to do that now. If you did it correctly, you're going to get the same successful like I just got. And that's all to it. So now if I hit the mic button, live TV. So once again, VOD. There you guys have it. As you guys can see, once again, the interface is uh, totally different. So let's try it one more time. Let's see if the third one opens up. Playback. And there you guys have it. Don't forget, guys, you could also quest the channel you want. Love that microphone feature. Discovery.
History. NBA. As you guys can see, it's instantly. This is great. I love these remote controls with the, the voice command. They really do make things a lot easier. Just so you guys know, with the S4 Pro, they did add a few more features. So the blue TV, now you could preview, you could actually change the aspect ratio. You could adjust it right there. There's no need to exit the app when switching the EPG style as well. And with the VOD, closed captioning is in English and Spanish. And you could also adjust the subtitle timing. And the playback speed is also adjustable as well. And you could also adjust the aspect ratio as well. And the playback, they also added an easier to find program. And once again, you could change the aspect ratio as well. Right here at the bottom, you got your settings. So you could do all your adjustments over here, folder, if you plug in a USB on the side and you want to access it, this is where you're going to find it. The rocket ship, what that is, and this one here I notice is a little small dot underneath it, but this cleans the box. So this will clean all your cachette and it'll free up a whole bunch of space. So right here, yeah, as you can see, it closed one package. I'm going to press it again and everything is cleaned up now. So this right here, this is for a speed test. If we click on it, it'll take you right to the Chrome. You have to accept. And there you go. So now I'll do a speed test. See what, what kind of uh, speed you're getting on your box. Garbage can. If you want to uninstall an app, that's how you do it right there. Voice command. I already programmed this remote. As you guys can see at the bottom, it does say connected. If you guys want to know how to program your remote, Check the description. I will have a link to a video that I did that shows you how to program the top buttons to your TV. This way you can control the volume on your TV inputs and power your TV on and off. Okay. So in order to do that, just check the description. I'll have the link there. So guys, if you're interested in this box, I will have a link in the description where you guys could get it. If you guys have any questions on it, please give me a comment below. If you like this video, hit those thumbs up. If you want to see more like it, make sure you hit that subscribe button. And like always, thanks for watching and have a great day.